and she taught me to relight, relight, relight again. Welcome to my channel. This is Nicholas No H back with another Vanda reaction video. Today it's going to be Van Vantan uh, and Vanda Point of No Return. I don't think I've heard Vantan in any capacity before, uh, unless you collab with Vanda and I forgot about it. So very much looking forward to that. Uh, I know Vanda always like meticulously collabs with people that he likes. He wants to put on. He thinks you know he he stamps them. He thinks they're good. Uh, same with production. So. If, if he's not producing his own stuff but um yeah should be dope if you've never been here before check out my playlist of vanda reaction videos uh i have a bunch of them yeah just over the last year uh just he's steadily been in my rotation and um you know i just i think someone recommended him so that's how i got introduced and ever since then just amazing every time i listen to him uh so i know this is going to be a banger yeah if you want more of this content on my channel please consider subscribing it really does help help us let me know what is wanted on here and i can try to get more of that for you guys if not i appreciate it nonetheless uh, let's get started. This is Vanda, uh, Vantan featuring Vanda. And yeah, can't wait. Three, two, one, let's go. Really got kind of like a vintage style sample going on, and also the visuals. Matching that a little bit. I was gonna, I was gonna ask if if Vantan is a singer or a rapper or if he does both. Right now, I'm just I'm hearing him sing, so that's really cool. Uh, and if he also raps, also dope. Yeah, either way, I think the visuals and the sounds so far are super cool. The beat kind of reminds me of like old western like cowboy like in, in america at least like two guys just walking out of the saloon they're, they're gonna duel each other quick draw or whatever kind of gives that tense sort of vibe uh with with the background um even though obviously it's more influenced by the cambodian uh like traditional type of sounds and stuff so it's, it's weird how that sound can can make me think of something else but yeah it's, it's cool either way I love that sample. It's very floaty too, like you're just in the clouds. Even though the lyrics are the, the lyrics themselves are very serious. That whistling coming in. Or an instrument to make it sound like a whistle. A flute of some sort? That's what I'm 
Pasaroy po ang insta yun Pagbong kong bide po ang nara way on Put po da chip ko loan di ay do ton Aw na niyang na Aw ibang sum to Pru on trop ko chi mui nang bong tran bong mo ka On nai chan te there's like faint keys in the background as well, the piano or keyboard. It adds a bit of a dramatic feel to this song. Damn, that went so quick. Yeah, definitely like, if not the cowboy western feel, it's like a 70s sort of feel. And I love all the, um, yo, shout out to all the crew that worked on this, but I love the um, outfits for everybody uh, and this kind of low key setting. Um, kind of like an underground bar area. Uh, yeah, it's like not, it's not modern. You're clearly going for the vintage feel there. Um, but yeah, this was really fun. I love the collab between, uh, Van Ten's vocals. Um, obviously, you know, Vanda, especially when he's trying to get emotional or, uh, talk about something deep. Um, and speaking about friends, enemies, past lovers, you know, current lovers, when he, when he puts his heart into it. There's always a story going on that you can follow, um, and he's gonna lay his heart out through the pen game. And I like the uh, like their voices on top of the uh, old sample. I don't know if it's like an old Cambodian singer or who that is, or um, yeah. But I love that as well. So there's just a bunch of things going on, instrumental as usual changes throughout the song. Uh, like what I've only heard Vanda's songs, not much Van then, but um, that's a staple of his style is that the instrumental will always change up always give you new things to uh, look out for and listen to and that's what I love about his music you just don't get the same thing the entire song it's always going to evolve and um, challenge someone to uh, you know pick up new sounds and listen to that so uh, this is really great I love the the collab between the two they didn't go for anything crazy like you know flow switches or uh, it was meant, meant to be more of a vibey song meant to actually mean something uh, and they pulled it off um, amazingly so, yeah fun little song there uh, let me know what you guys thought of this what I should check out next from um, either artist and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.